Welcome to Grace. My name is Brittany, and today we're taking a tour of campus. There's a lot to see and a lot that we love about Grace, so let's get started. Welcome to Indiana Hall. On the left side is the girl's side, and on the right side is the guy's side. But in the middle are a lot of important offices that you'll need as a student. So let's go check them out. Hey guys, how are you? Hey, welcome to the Student Involvement and Diversity Office. Okay, so what's all involved here in this office? Um, so basically this is where all the student-led organizations are. So whatever you're interested in, come right in and we'll get you plugged in. Some of our organizations include our intramurals program, service opportunities, and the Council for Diversity and Inclusion. Oh, thank you guys so much. We're gonna complete our tour, but we'll see you around soon. Up next is McLean. This is one of our academic buildings, so there's a lot of classes held here. And it's one of our oldest buildings, so a lot of the rest of campus was built around McLean. Hi guys! What I love about this building is a lot of our gen ed classes meet here. So if you're a first year student, you'll actually have a lot of classes here in McLean, especially in McLean Auditorium. Let's make a stop at Philathea. Philathea is home to some of our classes here on campus, but my favorite part about Philathea is that it's home to our campus Starbucks. This is a great place to study if you need a study break or just to get coffee with a couple friends. All right, we are on our way to Omega, which is one of our newer dorms. We're here at Omega, and I can't wait to check out the dorm. This is Andrew. Hey, do you mind showing us your dorm? Let's do it. My hall is survivor themed this year. I'm the RA on the hall. So yeah, I just got these little torches and the net around as well. But yeah, this is my room. It's well, very spacious. There's a lot to do. Um, I like to sit in my little beach chair. It's a cool aspect. And then spike ball and then my disc golf bags up there. Um, just good hobbies around Grace. And then for the setup, I just have my TV over here. Um, and then my study space is right here. And the best part about Omega is the AC. It's hidden behind my desk right here, but we always have the room set at 60, so it's very nice. Thanks for checking out Omega with me. Have a nice tour. So on our right is Kent. That is our apartment style housing, which is great if you're an upperclassman or wanting a little extra space complete with a kitchen. Further up the way is Beta. This is one of our older dorms on campus, but it's been recently renovated with our new balconies. And what I love is it's super close to the Winona Lake trails, which are just behind the building. Up here on the right is the lodge. On one side is the guy's side, on one side is the girl's side, but they have a great hangout area in the middle, which is fun if you wanna play games or just get to know other people on campus. As we're heading on, you're gonna see the Beta Field, which has a lot of great events throughout the year, but is also great for intramurals or just hanging out with friends and playing some spike ball. Up next is the Science Center. The Science Center is home to plenty of labs, study rooms, and classrooms, so it's the place to be if you're wanting a newly renovated space to get some work done. On the main floor, you'll find the Lily Center for Lakes and Streams. They exist to make sure our local waterways are clean and healthy. Let's check out our next stop. On your right is Alpha, which is one of our women's dorms here on campus. On the main level is the campus dining, so make sure to check that out if you visit campus. For now, let's check out the library. I'm here at the library with Tanya Fawcett. Tanya, can you tell us a little bit about what's offered here at the library? Well, certainly. We offer so much here for our students. When they get out of class and they have all that homework to do, this is the place to come. We have study help, we have tutors, we have the writing lab, we have study spaces, we have comfortable chairs, we have tables, we have group spaces, quiet spaces, and uh, it's, a, it's a great place to come and get some work done. Perfect. Well, thank you. Let's go check out those comfy chairs. All right. Up next is the MOCC. I'm here with Katie Parks, a current student. She's gonna tell us a little bit about it. Yes, I love the MOCC. We have all of our chapels inside. Also, I'm a business student, so all my classes are in the base of the MOCC. We also just had homecoming, which is so fun, but I love the MOCC. You could also swing by if you wanna check out a volleyball game or a basketball game. But for now, we've got another stop to make. So we'll see you later, Katie. See ya.
Here we are at Westminster Hall, or Westy. This dorm is awesome because it used to be a hotel, so now each room is a little bit different. And downstairs are two extra dining options if you want to change it up. It's also right next to Winona Lake Village, just down the hill. Welcome to the Village at Winona. There's a lot to see and do here with restaurants, places to shop, and my personal favorite, Light Rail Coffee Shop. Let's check it out. This is a great place not only to get coffee, but to get pizza or to study with friends. Let's go order. Thank you. Green apple jalapeno, whoa, that's interesting. What should we get? Maybe a cell sour? When you come to visit, make sure to stop at Cerulean. They have a creative menu and a great atmosphere overlooking the canal. Let's go check out the lake. Maybe one of the best parts of going to Grace is the lake that's just steps away from campus. Thank you so much for coming on our tour and we hope to see you on campus soon.